I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um... Sorry guys, we're trying to run a, a bunch of stuff all at the same time. I'm guessing this is a loser's finals? This is loser's finals? Yeah, this is loser's finals. Who's this? Huh? This is Tink. Yeah. Uh, uh, what? I will. I will. Because now I can... Why is some... I don't think stop. Alright, there we go. Oh, we can go to... We can go to food, though. But I can't. I've never done it before. I believe in you. These are the right people. Is the score and everything right? Yeah, everything's right. Okay. All right, the trail knock lights up. Yeah. All right, everybody. This is going to be losers finals for melee singles. This is going to be Lance from the Pants versus Tink. As I guessing you just saw, Lance was just knocked out by Trail. Looking very akin to last bought me. Lance gets put in the win losers finals. And uh, this is very similar to the grand finals we just saw in doubles, which is Tink, Tink and Lance both being in there. Of course, I honestly, to be fair, I haven't seen a whole lot of Tink's play, so we'll have to see, you know, just how this goes through and who's a better Falco than Lance. I don't, I have no clue. <laughs> I know I've heard his name thrown around quite a bit, but. Anyway, so this is going to be a Falco Ditto. Lance is, from what I've seen, played quite a few Falco Dittos around here today. I mean, it's Melee at Purdue, we're going to see a lot of Falco Dittos. But honestly, if it's Loser's Finals, clearly these are like two of the best Falcos here, so it's going to be interesting. What's it take? Let's go Lance. Alright, what well, is good chat? Does everything sound okay? <clears throat> Alright, so Lance is sitting at a, well not a full stock advantage here, but a decent one. Spacey matchups are honestly, you know, they can be pretty goofy sometimes, and people can drop stocks at, you know, 40, 20, 30 percent. It can be ridiculous, but the way it's looking now, Lance is pretty dominant. He got that th got that third stock off Tink. Three stocks to one, Tink's gonna have to do something drastic to come back here. Interesting light shield on the ledge by Lance there. Alright, thanks Lance here. Great backers by Lance. Backer into the forward smash. Lance gets one up. Tink dancing around here. Alright, so I know Tink plays multiple characters, so I'm gonna be it's gonna be interesting to see if Tink's maybe gonna try to go with a Marth or a Puff or whatnot here. Lance, is it gonna be like the claw and take eight minutes to pick the? Is it gonna be like the claw and take eight minutes to pick the pants? <laughs> All right, where do we go? That was good. All right, let's start back over there again. I'm gonna stop my T.O. I'm gonna take it. I'll take it. I don't. I should take it to try the best stage like a fountain with a fountain drink, but that's still random. That's pretty fucking random. <laughs> 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 No, no, no. Challenge on his level. He, he beat me twice on that level. I'm like, set the shield on it. Oh, see, why don't I set my shield? I don't even put that shield up. Alright, let's go. Uh, let's go. Alright, I'll set it. You beat out of it. Alright, so we're going to the battlefield. Tink is switching to Fox. Uh, generally, generally, Fox is considered a bad matchup, but we can see how this is going to go. I, from what I saw in doubles, Tink's Fox was better than his Falco, but. Maybe Lance is more experienced. Lance does definitely play Normac quite a bit, so it's not not unfair to say that he doesn't have experience in this matchup. Very good combo. Does not get that down smash that he wants, so that would have been the end of Fox. Tink got a solid 40% on him for missing it, though. Great forward smash by Lance. He does not get that edge guard, though, but gets the side beat. Very nice by Lance. I mean, even this game back up. It's a 40% advantage, but 
It's not that big of a deal in this matchup. King just facing out these back airs and he's landed quite a few. Back air is a, back air is a really good tool against Falco. As you can see right there, it pretty much just ruins his recovery. Tink's just playing the defensive game here. Playing defensive is really what you need to do when you have the lead, because capitalize the lead as much as you can. And here's the here's like kind of reverse of what we had last game from Tink right now. Alright, just using those up tilts, looking like Smash 4. Great back air. Tink's gonna get that edge guard. That was a very dominant game by Tink. I'm guessing he'll stick with Fox for this next match. This is thinking of a stage right now. Alright, looks like Tink might switch to Falcon here. I mean, his Fox was playing really well, so I wouldn't really see a need for a character switch. I didn't quite hear what stage we're going to, though, so... Alright, stick with that Fox. I definitely agree with his choice. They're going to Falcon. Uh, that's an interesting counter pick from Lance. I see a lot of Falcons don't like this stage because it can mess with uh, Shiffle lasers, but see how it works. Alright, there's a lot of neutral game coming out. A lot of shines, but that's how these matchups go. And that's not really capitalizing off that up tilt. Let's take a position you probably doesn't want to be. Alright, we got jabs. We got side B off stage. Lance looking like the CPU right now. Let's see if he can bring this back. Alright, great down smash. Keep him off stage. Let's hit him with the get up tag. Tank was going for some sort of shine thing, it looks like. Great down tilt, it's not capitalized off of it. He's gonna get that edge guard. Oh, he will not. Wow, great tech by Tank on that down smash. They're just slugging each other right now. Alright, sorry about that guys. Little uh, technical thing I had to fix real quick. Alright. Shine. Ooh, a great combo by Lance. Almost killing Tink there, but Tink gets back. Lance just throwing some lasers. Great. Nice in there. Almost gets him with the spike. You gonna comment? All right, sweet. So we have Hunt joining us on commentary. So Tink's edge guards have been looking really good this set. Like, there's not many times Lance has actually gotten off the stage that Tink like has let him back on. And I think that's really what's been giving Tink like the edge in this. It's a good power shield. This is still definitely a doable match for oh, yeah. Lance. Lance fights Fox all the time, he knows how this works. Oh yeah, he knows how this works. One touch and he can be gone. There it is. Right. He's been putting in a lot of work at this down smash. Mm -hmm. yeah, so Tink's just trying to be able to use the idea. Okay, that's good shit. Lance just trying to give himself some breathing room. But Tink's not really getting mm -hmm. into it. Those magnet hands. Good off smash. Oh wow, I didn't think that would kill. That was ridiculous. Alright, 2-1. Is this gonna be the first pop me where Lance isn't in grand finals? <laughs> That'd be ridiculous. Uh, nah, that's good though. That's good. Yeah, it's nice that we have variety. Yeah. Alright, so they're going to Yoshi's. Really, there's a, there's a multitude of people that could could have been here or in grand finals today. One of them ob obviously being great. Mm, yeah, right. Good job, so, uh, what do you think about this counter pick from Lance? You think this stage would be good in this matchup? I think Tink is pretty good at dealing with the lasers, and this just kind of makes it more of a close 
post up match, which is what Lance wants. He's used to being in on the box, beating up on him. He doesn't really need more that much room for the ladies. He's really not trying to uh, use that as his neutral very much right now. And also, like, it seems like a lot of Lance, Lance couldn't really land a lot of edge guards. So just being able to kill Fox earlier on the stage is definitely going to help him out. Yeah, he, the guesswork was definitely not there earlier in the set. Alright, that was interesting. Rand I think that was Randall messing him up. With yeah, Randall is getting involved. I like this counter take by Lance now. Yeah, it seems to be working out for him. He's got a pretty much a full stock ahead. One thing I do like about the way Lance plays is if he gets a hit, he's gonna get at least two or three more. He doesn't usually squander a hit. Interesting F smash. Probably trying to bait like a shine or whatever. Yeah, something on shield. Yeah. Tink is very good at these power shields. Alright, Lance seems to have stage control. Tink's just kind of kind of float to the platforms and try to see if he can do anything. That was that was Riggs. Huh? <laughs> that was Riggs and all of them. That's all people know. Alright, strong back air. Yep. It's 2 2. It's a very close set. <laughs> good matches, good matches. They both exchanged a 3 stop now, yeah. actually. Where's your mouth? So I wonder if Tink's gonna stick with Fox, or maybe he's gonna try a Marth or hmm? Falcon. He seemed to be considering Falcon earlier, so no, he's not. He's, he's not gonna switch. If he does, he's going Marth. But I don't, I don't see him switching. Apparently, Tink does not know how the stage banning thing works. Oh, the keys on the table. The less you have in your pockets, the better you are at this game. That's a true statement. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to Pokemon. Uh, Odd choice. Uh, yeah. This stage is kind of easy, I'd say, right? Yeah, you I, I feel like game. I remember uh, Tink went running away with the game on Pokemon City earlier, but I might be wrong. Let's well, go find out. Have these two fought in a bracket yet, or is this the first time? This is the first time. Alright. I didn't know if Lance put a tank up on it. I honestly can tell you, I was not paying attention. <laughs> Alright, so Tank already got a decent advantage. Of course, Falco can kill him pretty much any percent he wants. Let's see what happens. They both can pretty much do that to each other. Yeah, true. At any point in time. So oh, wow. Okay. Lance has been on point with these forward smash raids. He's been on point with all of his smash attacks. True, yeah. Maybe had one and two missed in neutral last game. Oh! Ooh, jab the down smash. That was interesting. Right, up throw does not get much off of it, though. So many of these sets today have been just down the wire. Yeah. Well, that's good, though. It's nice to have even players. Mm -hmm. I guess that's why we have pools. Alright, Lance trying to make this lead back. Nice spot back. Oh, he's in the middle of like the other way. It's about to see. It's a soccer right one. He would love to see this. <laughs> well, that's probably a big reason Tink would want this stage, right? Because the low ceiling. Yeah, yeah. And I guess... He, he doesn't care. He wants more space, I, I guess, to run around and whatnot. He doesn't give a shit about the laser, apparently. Alright, good combo by Lance. Gets him with the back air, but that is not the direction Lance wanted to go. It's another force on this guy. Even game again. 2-2. Two, two. Game 5. Oh. Um. They're both on point. 
Yeah, they're playing. They're both playing really well. Mm, gotta get that break pressure. Oh, very good. Oh, Lance, I'm gonna make it. Back, don't sleep on your Oh, you wanted to turn around with that man, but it's all good. I'll get it next time. Mm. Yeah, Lance learns from his mistakes really well, and I think that's what makes him a good player. Or one of the reasons. I think. Shit. <laughs> oh shit. Too high. Alright, we got the claps in the background. Oh, we're lazy. <laughs> Clap stop, I guess. <laughs> these S. -S yeah, yeah Lance is really good with these S. -S. And once again, they have very doable for both of them. I think, uh, I think Lance has got the moments to come in. Oh, the trade. Oh my god, it's the closest game. Jeez, good shot on him. See, he's playing very well today. Mm -hmm. I haven't really seen him play too much before this. But I know he's been around for a while. Alright, on the platform, this is not where Lance wants to be. Oh, oh, oh that mid Very good down smash. Tink makes it in the grand finals. Wait, this is we talked about these mid ranges and you had that up there.